All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, let's go see what's going on at the club. It's a smooth ride, too. Look at this. Handles pretty good. Doesn't resist controls. I only have to drive one or two people. Morning, Eddie. Hey, Vito. I'd like to introduce you to somebody. Vito, this is Carlo Falcone. Pleasure to meet you, Mr. Falcone. Vito? So, Vito, how do you feel about Alberto Clemente and Luco Gorino? Well, honestly, Mr. Falcone, the way I see it, those assholes tried to steal 5,000 bucks from me and then left me to rot in jail. That's good. Because the two of them are planning to make a move on us. So it looks like we're going to have to do something before they do something. Eddie will tell you the rest. I'm sure you won't let me down. Goodbye, Mr. Falcone. Nice to meet you, Vito. So what the hell's going on? A car with three of our guys in it disappeared last night, and word around town is that Luca might have had something to do with it. Who's missing? Harvey Beans and the two guys who were supposed to be protecting him, Tony Balls and Frankie the mm -hmm. Mick. Yeah. Beans is Carlo's accountant. If he talks, we're all fucked. What do you need me to do? I need you to wait for him in front of Freddy's and follow him to find out if he's involved. And then? If you find out that he had anything to do with this, you whack the bastard. And if any of our guys is still alive, try and rescue them. Hopefully you can find them before they spill the beans about our operation. Where do you think he'll go? I got no idea. So go prepared. Make sure you've got a fast car and some firepower. All right, no problem. Okay, stop by here when you're done. And Vito, don't tell nobody about this. Got it. Good morning. Sir. Okay, power plays all over the place. I feel like I'm back playing Swotor again. <laughs> Speaking of which, we do need to uh, do that at some point. Go back to Eridor because I don't, um, I don't know how long it, how long it is, but some new DLC came out for it, so we're gonna do that sooner or later. It's got something to do with Darth Malgus. Rogue at the end of the, uh, the last DLC. I also feel like it's kind of a continuation of, from Onslaught. I don't know. But it's taking us to Dantooine, and I'm fucking excited as hell. Speaking of DLCs, we also got the uh, Wrath of the Druids one for AC Valhalla coming out. This is Luca's car. Now, where are you, Luca? There you are. Okay, here we go. Shouldn't get too close. I gotta make sure Luca doesn't see me. All right, off we go.
Is he swerving around? Jeez. Where are you going, Luca? Riverside. <laughs> Of course. Looks like Eddie was right. Okay. I gotta get in there without being seen. Random homeless guy. This looks like it might do it. The sewer. Maybe that's the way in. Looks like I can pry this off. And in we go. Jesus Christ, that reeks. Yeah, it's gonna smell terrible. Weapons are not allowed in here. Okay, it's the sewer. I don't see why. Shit, that dog could be a problem. I mean, it's been barking like crazy since before we even pulled up, so maybe, maybe it's going through some. Ah, fuck! Jesus Christ! Ugh. Ah! Oh! If Luke could just stop by to pick up some steaks, I'm gonna kill somebody. Okay. Yeah, I don't see how anybody's gonna not notice me because of my smell. Just covered in sewage. Find out where they're being the held. It looks like all the way back control. there. So it's a question of now getting to them. Hey, don't spend all day out here. I don't want to do this by myself. Just having one fucking smoke. Relax. Yeah, I heard that one before, pal. Already torturing somebody. Let's, let's close this door. So, uh, you still 
thinking about quitting? Okay, okay. Yeah, probably next month. Jesus. Okay. I was thinking of maybe you know, slowly becoming a voice actor. Can't get in through that way. Hey, you two. Shift's over. What do you mean, shift's over? You got shit in your ears? I said you're done for today. But I ain't done pounding the beefsteak. Don't make me say it again. Shift's over. Get the hell out of here. All right, fine by me. Damn straight. Let's go. Let's wait until they leave. It's one guy. about the dope. I know where you got the money. Falcone thinks he's got a good racket going, but he ain't gonna get away with it. Come on. How'd you get it into the States? I don't know anything. I'm just an accountant. Don't fuck with me, you egghead bastard. You wanna end up just like your buddy here? Come on. Take a good look. You think you're tougher than him? After we're done with you, we're gonna grind you up in one of these machines here. <laughs> It's it's just a question of whether I'm gonna be nice enough to fucking kill you first. <laughs> hey, what's that fucking stench? Oh. Hey, hey, somebody's Drop over there. Hey, who the fuck are you supposed to be? Jesus Christ, what what is Captain Shipbag here to save the day? Shut the fuck up, Luca. Hey, I know you. You're the chump who was hanging around with that moron, Barbaro. I thought you were still rotting in the can. What the fuck you think you're doing here? Falcone sent me. He isn't too fond of skinny little cocksuckers trying to turn his guys into mincemeat. So, you joined up with Falcone, huh? Well, I'll tell you what. If you knew what was really going on, you'd realize that you was better off in jail. But that don't matter now, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Hit me, you big bastard. Come on, Sammy, not some channel. Break the quest. This guy sure can't take a beating, huh? This is gonna be a messy one. Oh my god. Hold on. Oh no. Oh no. I broke the quest. Is there... I don't want to have to redo the whole thing. Fuck it. Oh! Oh, sweet. Okay, good. I don't know what happened. Come on, 
Someone share me that so channel. There we go. Assholes. Oh, for crying out loud. Will you get me down, please? Thanks, Vito. We owe you one. Eddie send you? Yeah, yep. he noticed he was a couple of guys shy at roll call. Shit. Poor Frankie. I'm gonna kill that son of a bitch. Beans, stay here and don't come out until we come get you. Okay, okay. Just don't forget about me. Okay, fellas? Where are they coming from? Over here? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> okay. All right, Vito. Let's get that little fuck. Little cocksucker's gonna piss his pants. What's going on? Get yeah, they are. Guess who's next? Too late. Here they come. Okay, that didn't work out very well. Don't pop out. You scared asshole! Ah, damn it. I was way too close for that. Yeah. Shit. Poor Frankie. I'm gonna kill that son of a bitch. Beans, stay here and don't come out until we come get you. the third Sucker's gonna piss his pants. Yeah, they are. 
And guess who's next? A lot of guys, but a lot of cars are already on their way over here. They can't wait. How is it, uh... Nice job. Now let's go get that little cocksucker. Knock, knock. Come on. Let me in. Okay. All good. Not budging. Can't do it, man. Oh, that's too fucking bad. I ain't gonna be able to open it like this. Nope. Yeah, we need something heavy, like a like a battering ram. I know. We'll use that cart. Join me? Uh, thanks for the invitation, but I think I'll pass it. Uh, 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 no, just hate the sight of Luca. I hear you, but you're missing out. I think I'm gonna try out that cattle prod he was yapping about. Uh, yeah, Eddie wanted me to take care of him personally. Don't worry about that. It'll just take a little longer this way. This fuck don't deserve a quick death. I can't argue with that. Okay, I'm gonna go. I stink like an outhouse. I gotta get cleaned up. And tell Lady he don't gotta worry about Luca. Yo, Beans, open the door. It's all over. You? You're still alive? Yeah. What'd you expect? Look, before we go home, you wanna give me a hand with Sleeping Beauty here? You know, that's not such a bad idea. Well, he sure as fuck got what was coming to him. I can't hop down here. And just for, you know, some pain and suffering relief, I'm taking his car. Is it gonna just... Okay, good. Oh, 
covered in sewage, driving this nice ass car. GPS just never gives me a straight shot to it, does it? we go. And he's going, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh Jesus Christ, was that you? Vito? Oh, Jesus. Why didn't you take a fucking bath before you came back? You told me to come right back when I was done. You think I'm enjoying this? Okay, okay, okay. What happened with Luca? It's done. All right. How about our guys? You find them? Yeah. Luca had him in the slaughterhouse. Frankie's dead. But balls and beans are fine. Luca was, uh, interrogating him when I got there. Any witnesses? Well, except for a dozen or so whoa, of Luca's whoa. bodyguards who hey, ran back, into nobody. Back up, okay? It was rough, Eddie. Yeah, it sounds like it got pretty hairy. But hey, you pulled it off and you got out of there in one piece, right? So go get cleaned up before you ruin everybody's appetite. And burn those fucking clothes you're wearing. My God. Just burn the damn clothes. You smell like shit. Change your clothes. Oh, my God. All right, where's their clothing store at? Okay, it'd be nice to uh, get a new update on clothing anyway. Where's that? T oh, it was just taking me to a store. Okay. Or it was either doing that or guiding me home. Either way, the mission of changing clothes is accomplished. Jesus, look, he's just a mess. All right, pal, let's make it quick. You stink. I know. What are you looking at? Stylish and economical. Good choice, sir. All right. If you like what you see, let me know. Right, let's go back to, uh... Take care. Go back to the bar. See what's up.
clutch was just absolutely dead. Hey, Vito, you made it. Hey, Eddie. Oh, nice threads. Thanks. So, uh, what's the plan, fellas? What's with the suits? Vito, Mr. Falcone is gonna bring us into the family tonight. You and me, we're gonna be made. Oh, shit. Tonight? Yeah. Really? Why didn't you tell me before? What do we gotta do? You'll find out. But first, there's somebody who'd like to have a little word with you. Leo, good to see you. What are you doing here? <laughs> hey, kiddo. I want to talk to you about what's going to happen today. Come here, have a seat. All right. <sighs> sure. And hey, thanks again for doing whatever you did to get me out of the can early. Now I make good on my second promise to you. Second promise? Yeah. I told you the next time we opened the books, we'd recommend you, didn't I? And now it's done. You had something to do with this, but you work for Frank Vinci. Yeah. I would have liked to have had you in our family. But I figured Joe there is your best friend. You guys grew up together, just like me and Frank. Since Joe was working for Carlo the whole time you were inside, I recommended they take you in too when he got made. Thanks, Leo. I, I don't know what to say. You don't gotta say nothing. Not to me or anybody else. That's kind of the way this whole thing works, Vito. <laughs> yeah. Now, oh, come on. We don't want to keep him waiting. All right. I'll see you fellas upstairs. What was that all about? Nah, nothing. Just, you know, talking about old times. Like that time when old Leo dropped the soap. Fuck you. All right, all right, all right. That's enough. Let's go. These are like two school kids, I swear to God. All right, wait here. Now listen to me, fellas. It's one at a time. Once you're inside, just do as you're told, okay? Joe, come on in. Hey. Good luck. All right, your turn, Vito. Gentlemen, this is Vito Scaletta. Vito, know that this family of ours is a secret. You are entering the Society of the Chosen, a society which does not exist to the rest of the world. Our family means more to you from now on than your own family, or God, or your country. If I ask you to kill your own brother, you must do it. Show me. Which finger would pull the trigger? Repeat after me, Vito. If I were to betray the secret of our way of life... If I were to betray the secret of our way of life... May my soul burn in hell, just like this saint. May my soul burn in hell. Just like this saint. Amico Nostra. Gentlemen, I give you our new friend, Vito Scaletta. I am very pleased to have these two talented and honest men join us. And I'm happy this has happened in the presence of our esteemed guests, especially Don Frank Vinci. And his consul. You might wonder why I take this risk again after spending almost seven years in a can. You see, where I grew up, the only guys who mattered were the guys who had the balls to take what they wanted. You will receive payment for your services from Eddie. Would you like to add anything, Frank? Whatever you do, gentlemen, stay away from the dope. No dope. That's our policy. You can make plenty of money. And after years of doing everybody else's dirty work, too many risks. Well, I was willing to risk anything to finally be somebody. Let's have some fun. You only live but once, but when you did, you done. So let the good times roll. Let the good times roll. Don't care whether you're young or old. I'll let the good times roll. Don't sit there mumbling and talking trash. If you want
gonna have a ball, you gotta spend some cash. So let the good times roll. Let the good times roll. Don't care whether you're young or old. I'll let the good times roll. If you wanna have a ball, you gotta spend some cash. So let the good times roll. Let the good times roll. All right, look at that. Rich. Oh god, it's glitching again. Where's the phone? Where's the phone? Hello. Hey, Vito. It's Eddie. Hey, Eddie. What's up? I need you to come over to Joe's right now. <sighs> yeah. Oh, okay. All right. What's happening? I, I can't tell you over the phone. All right. I'll be right there. All right. Let's get dressed and see what's up. Let's see what this looks like. I can't really, I can't really see. Looks nice, but I do like the raincoat aesthetic. Maybe we can get an expensive version of one. Oh no. Did I put, is this, no, this was just the last car I drove. It's not in my garage, is it? Let's drive the favorite. We'll see what's up. Let's see, where exactly are we? You know what? Since we're here, let's stop by Harry's. And I have, what was that, over $10,000? You know, I know he said as soon as possible, but you know, who cares? <laughs> it's a game. Plus, you don't like black hole everything you own on your character at all times. I gotta get the car cleaned. It's me, Vito. Come on in. Hey, so, Harry. You need serious hardware or just a pistol? Happy hunting, Vito. Here you go, Vito. Four Happy grenades. hunting, Vito. I'll give them crowds credit for one thing. They make a damn fine killing machine. Here you go, Vito. Like my mom always said, you can never have too much ammo. All right. We're strapped. Now let's go see, go to Joe's. Get in. Oh god. No, you bastard. Not getting in front of me. Oh my god. <laughs> Ew. 
You know what, if we pass a body shop, I'll get her fixed up. Oh my god. Oh, that's a gun store. Oh, we have to get on the freeway, that's right. Probably just kept the keys to the back door when he moved out. Man, I went on with a baseball bat and they looked like they were scared till morning, yesterday. Fellas. Oh, hey, good morning, Vito. Marty, what are you doing here? Joe said you needed help. And since I did good with the greasers, he said he'd take me along again. Take you along again for what exactly? They're waiting for you. Yeah, well, uh, uh I'll talk to you later. <laughs> yeah, that's my man, Vito. <laughs> Morning, Mr. Falcone. Hi, Vito. Take a seat. Hey, guys. <clears throat> so what's happening? I heard how you got rid of Luca, Vito. Good job. Thanks to you, we now have proof that Clemente was behind the attack on our guys. We couldn't do anything to him openly till now. He just cut his own throat. He kidnapped and tortured our guys, and that means war. Anything we do now, I'm going to be able to justify before the commission. Alberto knows this. So he's gonna act quickly and try and come after us first. So we're gonna take out Clemente. Exactly. Turns out Clemente called a big meeting in the Empire Arms Hotel today. This is our best chance to get rid of him and his top guys. Oh, sure, yeah. We'll just waltz right in there and kill a few dozen heavily armed men in broad daylight in the nicest hotel in town. Is that about right? Don't worry. I got a plan. Shit! Joe, put that thing away. Eddie, don't worry. It's safe. I just got to press Christ this. Sake, put it away now. Okay, What's the with you? okay. You're such a chicken shit. Okay, okay. So now we're going to waltz right in and blow up the nicest hotel in town. Isn't that overkill? Don't worry. This thing ain't that powerful. It won't blow up the whole building, but everybody in the room where it goes off is dead meat. How are we going to know when to detonate it? We'll use a window washing platform. We'll almost be able to watch it explode. Since when are you the smart one? Okay, fellas. I'm counting on you. If all goes well, I'll have something nice for you. When it's over, call Eddie at this number. Oh, by the way, I closed the bar today, just in case Alberto tried something. Hey, good luck, fellas. Hey, what about that kid in the hallway? You mean Marty? Uh, he ain't part of the organization, so he had to wait outside. I mean, why is he here at all? Why do you think? He's going with us because we need a getaway driver and somebody to cover our asses. What do you got against him anyway? I known him since he was a little kid, and he saved my ass with them greases. Yeah, but we're not fighting a bunch of drunk dirtbags this time. We're about to take out the most powerful family in this city, and you're bringing a kid. And how old were you when you started doing this shit? You're talking like you're some old fart. Look, Vito, he's gonna wait in the car outside and drive us away. That's it. He ain't even gonna know what we're doing there. He's a great driver, and that's exactly what we need on this one. Okay, Joe, whatever. But I'm telling you right now, this is a bad idea. All right, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, thank you so very much for joining me. When we return, we're going to kill Alberto Clemente, which is going to be fun. <laughs> so 
Thank you so much for watching. If you're on YouTube, please like, comment, subscribe on Twitch. Drop me a follow if you haven't already. And I will be back tomorrow.